The Labrador Peninsula is a large peninsula in eastern Canada. It is bounded by the Hudson Bay to the west, the Hudson Strait to the north, the Labrador Sea to the east, and the Gulf of St. Lawrence to the southeast. The peninsula includes the region of Labrador, which is part of the province of Newfoundland and Labrador, and the regions of Saguenay Lac Saint Jean, Côte Nord, and Nord du Quebec, which are in the province of Quebec. It has an area of 1,400,000 square kilometers, 541,000 square miles. Topic: <laughs> Location and geography. Topic: The peninsula is surrounded by sea on all sides except for the southwest where it connects to the mainland. The northwestern part of the Labrador Peninsula is shaped as a lesser peninsula, the Ungava Peninsula, surrounded by Hudson Bay, the Hudson Strait, and Ungava Bay. The northernmost point of the Ungava Peninsula, Cape Wolstenholme, also serves as the northernmost point of the Labrador Peninsula and of the province of Quebec. The peninsula is a plateau threaded by river valleys. There are several mountain ranges. The Torngat Mountains, located in the northern part of the peninsula, contain the highest point of the peninsula Mount Kovvik, which at 1,652 metres 5 feet is also the highest point of mainland Canada east of Alberta. The mountains also host Torngat Mountains National Park, the only national park of Canada on the Labrador Peninsula. The park is located in the province of Newfoundland and Labrador, whereas the adjacent Kururuwak National Park is located in the province of Quebec. Topic. Hydrology Topic. Due to it being covered almost entirely by the Canadian Shield, a vast, rocky plateau with a history of glaciation, the peninsula has a large number of lakes. The province of Quebec alone has more than half a million lakes of varying size. The largest body of water on the Labrador Peninsula is the Kaniapichau Reservoir, but the largest natural lake is Lake Mistassini. Other lakes of note include the Manicouagan Reservoir, the Smallwood Reservoir, the Kaniapichau Reservoir, and the La Grande II and La Grande III Reservoirs. Due to a history of hydroelectric development, the majority of the larger freshwater lakes on the peninsula are reservoirs. In addition to an abundance of lakes, the peninsula also has many rivers. The longest, the La Grande River, is 900 kilometers (560 miles) long and flows westwards across nearly half the peninsula. Other rivers of note include the East Main River, Rupert River, and Churchill River. Topic: History. Topic: Prior to European arrival, the peninsula was inhabited chiefly by Cree people, as well as the Innu people in the southeast area of the peninsula, who referred to their land as Natasinan, meaning "our land," in the Innu language. The area was known as Markland in Greenlandic Norse and its inhabitants were known as Skralingher. It is widely accepted that the peninsula is named after Portuguese explorer João Fernandes Lavrador. He was granted a patent by King Manuel I of Portugal in 1499 which gave him the right to explore that part of the Atlantic Ocean as set out in the Treaty of Tordesillas. Together with Perro de Barcelos, he first sighted Labrador in 1498. Fernandez charted the coasts of southwestern Greenland and of adjacent northeastern North America around 1498 and gave notice of them in Portugal and Europe. His landowner status allowed him to use the title Lavrador, Portuguese for farmer or landholder, while Labrador in Spanish and Galician means agricultural worker, Portuguese pronunciation, o. Oh. Fernandez actually gave the name of Terra do Lavrador to Greenland which was the first land he sighted, but eventually the name was spread to all areas and finally was set for Labrador. References, <references>